So I thought I'd record a little bit of our eclipse that we're having out here in California. This is the beginning of it. Try to get the camera pointed right at it. It's very hard to do. I'll uh, keep making some clips as the time goes along. You can see that the sun is, uh, I'd say, about 25% obscured right now. I can get it back in focus here. There we go. It's about 25% obscured by the moon at this point. And here we are, a few more minutes into the eclipse. It's hard to hold my little point-and-shoot camera steady as the sun keeps moving. I've got it zoomed out pretty far here. Try to get it back in focus. Anyhow, that's what we're looking at out here in Northern California right now. So a few minutes later into our endeavor of the eclipse today. Here's the point that we're at so far. About half of the sun has been obscured by the moon. Okay, here we are, a few more minutes into the eclipse. Try to get some static shots of the sun. You can actually see it moving in the sky. I've got the stabilizer turned off in the camera. So here we are, a little bit farther along in our eclipse up here in California. It's moving along quite nicely at this point. We're at, um, oh, I would just have to say about 75% covered. We should be getting into the ring of fire here pretty soon. Try to get some video of that to post as well. So here we are, a few more minutes into our eclipse. And uh, as you can see, the moon is probably obscuring 75, 80% of the sun at this point in time. It's very hard to keep the camera steady. The moon is moving, or the sun and the moon are moving so quickly. We should achieve the ring of fire very shortly here. Here we are looking at the ring of fire. It's almost complete. You can almost see the moon blocking the entire sun at this point. Who's next one? Who's this? <laughs> oh, it's the one laughing. There it is. Oh, there I can see a complete ring I can too. all the way around the moon at this point. There we go. One ring to rule them all. Ha. Lord of the Rings jokes. Uh, that's awesome. One does not simply walk into Mordor. Be like, what, 40 or 50 years from now? This is awesome. 
birds are flying all over the place. Dogs are going crazy right now. They don't know what to do. It's like really weird looking out there. It's amazing with just the ring how much sunlight there still is. Yeah, it's pretty dark. I had to turn the lights on inside to see what I was doing. You can hear a dog in the distance whining. Uh -huh. That was truly amazing. Yep. We'll be coming out of the ring of fire here in just a minute. Yep. Try to keep the tripod on it as long as I possibly can. Is it me or is there more on the bottom? There's more on the bottom. Okay. At about um, 1.32 o'clock right now. It's just getting ready to break over it looks like. Very close. Hannah, are you watching? Yeah. Oh, where's Johnny Cash when you need him? I've got right. the fire in my head. He sung a song about this, the Rick of Fire. Almost. Cash is a country singer who has passed away. Ugh, I see two. There we go. <laughs> I mean, it probably would be better if I had my glasses on. My regular. Ooh, if I move it like that, there's two. All the shadows right now look very strange because of the reflections. What on the ground? Yeah. Not even close. Now I'd say that we've broken it. You think so? Yep. yep. The ring is broken. Alright. Alright, Missy. Now the light is going to begin. It's going to get hotter fast. <laughs> so I hope everybody out there enjoyed our little backyard commentary as we watched the ring of fire. This is what it looked like from Northern California up here around Sacramento. Just in case you're curious, here's what I'm using to take my pictures. I've got my little uh, point-and-shoot camera out here on a tripod. I've got my solar viewer glasses manufactured by Thousand Oaks Optical. And um, I'm pretty sure in the instructions it tells you not to use this with a camera, but um, it seems to be working quite well. Uh, don't use with binoculars, telescopes, or cameras. Um, I don't know why, but they uh, they seem to work out quite well.